G'day viewers, it's Blue Boy here again, and we've got two Cuban fiber tents or Dyneema tents, a duplex and a Flexamid, and I thought we might compare how the, the 0.5 ounce um, per square yard Cuban fiber has worn over time, because it's made. these are made out of the same material. So this duplex, which has uh, seen some use now, and it's now no longer mine, uh, I sold it to one of my work colleagues' wife, so Will and Jade, they kindly lent it back to me to do my Z-Packs tent off the other day. Uh, so thank you very much, guys. Um, so this duplex, uh, Jade has used this for a uh, through hike of the Lara Pinta Trail, which is uh, in the middle of Australia, a desert long uh, walk. And so it's got a bit of red dirt and red dust on it. So uh, we're going to see how the Cuban fiber has changed over time from an older tent to a brand new one. So let's have a look at it now. Okay, so we've got the two tents here, the duplex and the plexamid, and the Rudolph, aka Bonnie. She's gonna, can go she's gonna be my little helper. Um, so let's start with the duplex. Let's unwrap it and have a look at how the Cuban fiber has worn over time. There we go, there's the duplex. And then now we're going to do the plexamid. Bonnie, do you want to go in into the rumpus room in there and pick up the two yellow lights that are up? What room? In the in the big rumpus room in there, there's two room. there's two yellow lights. Come on, I'll go get them. So here we are. So we've got the duplex on this on your left side, and then the new uh, plexamid on the right hand side. Both of them are made out of the same blue, yummy yummy blue Cuban fiber plastic. Um, and at first visuals, you can probably see this one's a little bit darker blue. It's sort of gone a little bit greener, and this one is really quite still clean and, and, and clear and blue, whereas this one's gone a little bit more opaque, you can see. The cords are still nice and bright yellow, aren't they, Bonnie? Mm -hmm. Although this one's a bit more fluoro. Yeah. Cool. Because these ones are a bit dirty. They are a bit dirty, aren't they? So let's have a closer look at the Cuban fiber. And Bonnie, you can help us, look at this. <laughs> so here we go. So here is the old stuff. Now, I've got the light on there, so the light sort of makes it look a bit more, sort of, like, cleaner. Maybe if we go up like this, you can see, there's the old Cuban fibre. And then if we have this, the, the new Cuban fibre in the same shot, you can see, see that old Cuban fibre looks a bit older and wrinkly, wrinklier. Looks like it's got more wrinkles in it. When you get the light on it, it makes it, you know, look better than it really is. But here's the new stuff. Do you want to just hold that? Nice, like, hold it up like that for me, Bonnie. Okay. Nice and up like that. Let's see if we can see through it. Maybe if we put the light like this, we come back like this. Yeah, maybe, maybe not. <laughs> Still very beautiful. Maybe I'll bring the light from this side. So, you can see that it's really very, very clear and very, very clean. Now let's have a look at the old one. Do you want to hold the old one up as well, Bonnie? Wait. So maybe this bit here. There it is, and we'll turn this light around like this. Yep, beauty. I want to stand up because I don't like it. Yeah, well maybe just... Cool, so now this is the old one with the old Cuban fiber, and you can see, I don't know if you can see, it's a little bit more opaque because it's had a lot more sort of folds and creases and stuff. It makes it a little bit sort of more matte finish. So that's what happens to Cuban fiber as it gets used and and like rolled up and stuff. It comes more like crepe paper, crepe paper, a little bit more opaque. Um, lots more creases and stuff in it. It still looks good. And uh, looking at Dixie's um, homemade Wonderlust her blue Cuban fiber tarp or her fu fu uh, blue Cuban fiber duplex, it's even more. Um, like opaque than this one so there's the you can, oh, that's probably a good view there so you can see the difference in colors 
with the old one and then the new one let's have a look down here can I put this down? yeah put that down thank you uh, look at this one so you can see less creases and it's more more clear and more see-through cool okay thank you very much rudolph for your great help want to wave goodbye okay. bye, bye youtube <laughs> okay see ya bye these are good examples so there's the older duplex material this one duplex and then this is the new plexamid yep and you can have a look you can see there's the old material versus the new um new material so this goes a little bit sort of dark blue or worn blue and this is like more crisper crisper sky blue so there it is after a while versus a new one so they're more fresh cool come in here with me little rudolph i'll go back here well, they can't see you back there. It's just in this little bit spot here. No. Okay. Huh? Just crouch down in the front, look up at the camera. So keep looking at the camera. And you can wave it if you want. So, here we are.